the instrumental enrichment program, which we apply now with the elderly at risk for mental deterioration, is actually a program applied to a large variety of people of a di great diverse number of ages and disturbances and disabilities. This is a program which entices people to think, entices people to work based on certain principles which are given to them and they apply it in a very generalized way, in a repetitive way. And by this, they have the possibility to become much more alert, much more able to manipulate data, and much more able to remember data. The most important thing in this program is that we are imp imposing on the brain activities which are known now to modify the brain and to keep the brain able to function in a more adequate way. From this point of view, we have some very good results. People enjoy doing the work, feeling that their competency in doing certain tasks is growing daily as they do it, and this becomes a very meaningful and very powerful uh, reason why to come and do the job. And we may even think of the possibility of training the caregivers of the, of the uh, aged and the elderly by training them to do the work with the elderly. This would be the greatest achievement, a real win-win situation. This will enable them to have a common language which will be very meaningful for their fight against deterioration.